hello guys welcome back to my channel today i'm going to introduce to blender add-on called shape king gene this is blender add-on that allows you to generate all the 52 arcade blend shape for your red character this add-on support blender rigs like ultra pro regify and also your own custom red character so you have to check this video link in the description and but for ultra pro and regify everything is automatic so anyone who purchase this add-on is going to get this character for free so you can use it for your practice now let's back to the add-on here the add-on appear on animation tab after install okay so the first thing you have to do is select your character rig and then click on rename and you click on rename you see your character rig will be changed to other shape keys and from now you can register all your faces objects into the collection so we're going to select our character body and i'm going to add it to here and i'm going to select the eyeball and add them and the lower teeth uh, the upper teeth tongue also the eyebrows okay so these the facial features have to be added let's unhide everything and select character rig and click on transfer animation so here make sure you choose your rig type if your rig with rigify choose the metal rig if your rig with auto rig choose auto rig pro so this one is to rig with auto rig so i will choose the auto rig as stores rig and click on transfer animation and hit ok once we hit ok you can see you can see we have a bunch of keyframes on our timeline with markets and names so each keyframe is how we are is how the shaping is going to be looked okay so let me play the animation for you to see we see our character is moving its faces so this is what you are going to convert into the shape key or the blend sheet but you can see the character is not moving its faces much so let me go forward and see you can see it doesn't move much so here we can multiply we can scale the expression so let's say i want to scale the expression by 1.5 so i'm going to type 1.5 here and i'm going to click for auto rate you need to multiply all the lo location and leave the rotation in scale one one okay so i'm going to hit apply if you want to reduce the scale if the, it moves math less than one will decrease the strength higher than one will decrease the strength so i'm going to click on apply and now you can see the eye blink move down but let's keep this one we can go to push mode and check it so here all the animation strength is going to be increased i can see the mouth open more So that's good. So here we can also turn this one into image editor. So you change the outline to image editor. And then on frame 10, just click on show reference. And this will show you how the pose supposed to be look like. So here we can go to post mode. So there's only four posts or three posts you need to work on it. Usually the eye blink left and the eye blink right. So let's say this character, we want to make the eye blink supposed to look like this. So we can see the markers here. This eye blink left. So the character is supposed to blink the left eye. So here we can go through and move the bone to make him blink. So after I pose it to make it make it blink, press a select every time I to insert and let's insert location rotation and scale here. And now it will going to blink here. So anytime you move to um let's let me jump to next marker and we say this i look down left and this will show you how the eye left look down is supposed to look like see so let's click on jump this i look in left you can see it from a timeline jump 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 again and this eye spin so every every keyframe is supposed to match like this okay so let's go jump again jump and there is the eye blink right so it's supposed to be blink like this you see that one is not blinking make sure i've selected all your key poses are your bones and go to keys and copy keyframe let's go to the eye blink left go to keys and paste flip and this will make him blink so now we are done with the eye blink so only the eye blinks and holes you need to be fixed there is your open if you think this mouth open is good for you just keep it right here i'm going to decrease the strength you can always jump to push mode and you can push to match uh the reference here so anytime you jump it will show the reference so once you are done with looking at the reference just click on 
uh, clear reference and this will remove all this image that we got so from now the reference will show again now the next thing you have to do is just go to generate shaking and now we select our character you see we don't have any shaking for this character just click on generate shape keys and it's going to generate convert all these keyframes into shape key for all the objects who have been registered in the razor uh, face object in the collection so now it has successfully generated all the shape key for us so after it's generated you see it's not using the arcade's name so just click on make arcade and you see the names are going to be changed but i can see the uh, animation is still playing here so just select a category go to animation tool here and just click on clean rate this will delete all the markers and the animation from our timeline and now your character is not moving its faces again so now we select a character body let's go to here and let's make I blink and we see the cursor is blinking the eye that is very good so this one too. jaw open you see the jaw open here but we see the other one is not moving like the seat because it's separate object we need to use drivers to make them all move along okay so a jaw open to make them uh move the same i'm going to select uh let's go to drivers control there is driver's control there is my blender add-on it's also link in the description it is free that one is free so this will help you to control all the shaking by only one object so first thing you have to do is just select a model object press the one going to select the most visually the face of the face one or the head and just click on add to add that one so it's supposed to have in this one in the collection Press A, select all the other objects and click on Add and click on Collection Key Name and click on Create Drivers. Once you click on Create Drivers, we see the tank and it is snapped to the jaws. So right now, when I move this, you see all of them move along. Now I can use the head one to control. You see, all of them are going to have drivers that is controlled with this head object. That one is having the index one here. Okay, so now I can make the eye, uh, eye lean down with this one. You see. I look down and now you have your all your 52 arcade blend shape you can export this one to game engine or you can use your iphone to link it and control the face uh, in the mouth funnel to this side so the next thing you can do to improve your brain shape here is you can select your character and let's go to maybe the eye blade and then set the volume to one so once you have selected the eye blade, just go to your Adam session which is remote, and then click on show selected shaping once you click on it this will show you the selected shaking reference you see we have selected i blink left and this will show you i blink left how it's looks. so you can always go to scoped mode and you can this one is not using mirror so just turn off this s mirror and you can use the scope to smooth out or rework on your blend You can also go to eye blink right okay and click on show reference and this will show how the right one supposed so you can also use the scope to to work on it to make it so after you are done just click on clear reference and you can switch back to your out linear and now you have your character rig work here and also have your blend sheet so I'm going to include this character in the add-on. So if you purchase the add-on, you are going to receive this character for free. Okay, it's going to be for free for anyone who purchase this add-on. But if you want to get the full character that has been read with the shape king has been generated, you can always go to my this one. It's going to be linked in the description. It has this that can help you to work on it. Okay. See, so you can make blink this. Also, get extra 